Hi, I'm Dreen and in this video I speak about the Judgment Day. Um, uh, regarding New Age, I recently found a video of uh, Dari Lanka, the man who uh, channels Bashar, uh, speaking about a time when uh, people would be separated based on their energetic state, that the ones with the lower vibrations would end up in the lower vibrations and the ones with the higher vibrations would end up in the higher vibrations and they, that they would not have access to one another at some point anymore. That right now it was a time of choice where the lower vibrational realms were still available and accessible for all of us but that there would be a time when this would not be so anymore. Uh, so that was an interesting concept and we'll see what the future will bring. But uh, there is something similar to that uh, in the Bible uh, regarding Judgment Day. Uh, so John 5.25 says, Very truly I tell you, a time is coming and has now come when the dead will hear the voice of the Son of God and those who hear will live. And 28 says, do not be amazed at this, for a time is coming when all who are in their gra graves will hear his voice. And come out those who have done what is good will rise to live, and those who have done what is evil will rise to be condemned. So this also speaks about the separation of people at some point in time. But what is very questionable over here is that... Um, it says a time is coming and has now come. When later it says, do not be amazed at this, for a time is coming when all who are in their graves will hear his voice. Um, that it says that a time is coming and has now come. So, so my question over here is, uh, what does this mean? Does it mean that it has already come, that it has already, that it is already such a time or or it will be sometime in the future. Um, though the other verses in the Bible speak uh, speak about rather more of a futuristic time in that regard. Uh, for example, Revelation, the book of Acap Apocalyptic Prophecy, 2011 to 15 says, Then I saw a great white throne and him who was seated on it. From his presence earth and sky fled away and no place was found for them. And I saw the dead, great and small, standing before the throne, and books were opened. Then another book was opened, which is the book of life. And the dead were judged by what, has, what was written in the books, according to what they had done. And the sea gave up the dead who were in it. Death and Hades gave up the dead who were in them, and they were judged, each one of them, according to what they had done. Then death and Hades were thrown into the lake of fire. This is the second death, the lake of fire. And if anyone's name was not found written in the book of life, he was thrown into the lake of fire. So this speaks about a, someone's vision where they saw uh, what happened to the earth and uh, like a judgment day vision. Um, and it's interesting that it mentions the second death over here as well, the lake of fire. That uh, this has made me question whether the, this would be the death of the spirit, that there is a time when the body dies, but uh, also the spirit may end up dying at some point. So this can be what may be mentioned over here. So. I have got curious about that. In a previous video, I mentioned about the possibility of uh, judgment being constant instead of a one-time event. Uh, though the Bible seems to speak more about a specific time, uh, moment in time, uh, like a judgment day, uh, instead of a constant being to that. While it is still confusing when that time would actually be, uh, for example, Hebrews 9.27 says, And just as it is appointed for a man to die once, and after that comes judgment. Uh, so this says that after you die, a judgment uh, will come. Matthew 24.36 says, But concerning that day and hour, no one knows, not even the angels of heaven, nor the Son, but the Father only. For as, as were the days of Noah, so will be the coming of the Son of Man. 
40. Then two men will be in the field, one will be taken and one left. 43. But know this, that if the master of the house had known in what part of the night the thief was coming, he would have stayed awake and would not have let his house be broken into. Therefore you also must be ready, for the Son of Man is coming at an hour you do not expect. 7. Uh, for nation will rise against nation and kingdom against kingdom, and there will be famines and earthquakes in various places. All these are but the beginning of the birth pains. 9. Uh, then they will deliver you up to tribulation and put you to death, and you will be hated by all nations for my name's sake. And then many will fall away and betray one another and hate one another. And many false prophets will arise and lead many astray. And because lawlessness will be increased, the love of many will grow cold. But the one who endures to the end will be saved. And this gospel of the kingdom will be proclaimed throughout the whole world as a testimony to all nations. And then the end will come. 29. Immediately after the tribulation of those days the sun will be darkened, and the moon will not give its light, and the stars will fall from heaven, and the powers of the heavens will be shaken. Then will appear in heaven the sign of the Son of Man, and then all the tribes of the earth will mourn, and they will see the Son of Man coming on the clouds of heaven with power and great glory. And he will send out his angels with a loud trumpet call, and they will gather his elect from the four winds, from one end of heaven to the other. 34. Uh, truly I say to you, this generation will not pass away until all these things take place. Heaven and earth will pass away, but my words will not pass away. So these verses speak about the time of the judgment day, when this would happen, that there are certain things that need to unfold before all of the... Uh, all of that can happen um, and it has been said that when Jesus returns when the Son of Man returns then uh, then the judgment day would be but nobody really knows when this would happen but concerning that day and hour no one knows not even the angels of heaven nor the Son but the Father only And yet there are certain like things that need to happen before that. So it is interesting to see. So um, I find that there are similarities again with the New Age beliefs and uh, with the Bible. But what do you think about this? I'll leave in the comments below. Uh, like, share, subscribe and see you soon.